Leave the keys. You still do that thing? Leave the keys. for our biggest discounts on 30% recycled and ultra premium laser. Okay. Okay. Can I use your phone? Yeah, sure, go ahead. Let me talk to you about a few of the other things we can offer. Namely, we know the tax season's coming up, so by April 1st, we can have you fully stocked. One. We have discount prices on ink cartridges. Three. And also any forms that you're gonna need. Seven. You can custom make them. <laughs> what did you just say? Hi! You sounded like <laughs> my niece, and she's six months old. <laughs> well, I appreciate what you guys are saying, but it uh, makes more fiscal sense to go with one of the big guys. Sure, that's true. We can't compete with their prices, but let me ask you something. How important to you is customer service? It's very. Please keep holding. Your call is very important to us. Mm. That's one of the big guys. Been on hold this whole time. And this is Dunder Mifflin. Hey, Kelly, it's Jim. Oh, my God, Jim, how are you? I wanted to tell you. Here's my card. It's got my cell number, my pager number, my home number, and my other pager number. I never take vacations, I never get sick, and I don't celebrate any major holidays. <laughs> All right, I get it. We got a deal. <clears throat> All right. Hey, Kelly. Screw you. Excuse me. That is no way to address a superior. Oh, yeah? Screw you, too. Whoa. What was that all about? You forgot her birthday. It was yesterday. Go ahead. Go ahead. You do it. Okay. I insist. Basically, after Phyllis blackmailed Angela, Michael asked them both to step down from the party planning committee because there was too much drama. What he said was... Just easy. There was a problem with having one head of the party planning committee. She becomes too powerful, so he appointed two heads. Party planner? I'm a this is salesman. literally the stupidest this thing ever done. humiliating. That's on my side. So this is fun. Are you kidding? Well, I'm not done yet. Dwight, this fits in the palm of my hand. You haven't blown them up enough. Why have you chosen brown and gray balloons? They match the carpet. What is that? It is your birthday period. It's a statement of fact. Not even an exclamation point? This is more professional. It's not like she discovered a cure for cancer. I can't believe how bad this looks. Are you trying to hurt my feelings? Because if so, you are succeeding. Fortunately, my feelings regenerate at twice the speed of a normal man's. Okay, good then. Have you collected the money from everyone? I am working on it. How much do you have? Six dollars. That's how much you and I contributed! Damn it, Jim! I said I was working on it. <laughs> You have to write my suggestions down, too. I'm not writing horse hunt. I don't even know what that means. It's in the name. Okay, <laughs> so far, our ideal party consists of beer, fights to the death, cupcakes, blood pudding, blood, touch football, mating, charades, and yes, horse hunting. You're right. Forget horse hunting. It's stupid. Look, is there a birthday that you remember that you loved? Here's one. It was dark, warm, wet. A sudden burst of light, an intense pressure like I'd never felt before. Father, dressed in white, pulls me forward. Mother bites the cord. Hey, stop. Forever stop that story. That's disgusting, and it doesn't count. So give me another one. Schutz don't celebrate birthdays, idiot. It started as a Depression-era practicality and then moved on to an awesome tradition that I look forward to every year. What about you? Actually, when I was seven, my dad took me to the Natural History Museum in New York. And we looked at fossils all day. And at the end of the day, he got me a little plastic triceratops. It was awesome. That's cool. Hey, you know what's even cooler than triceratops? Every other dinosaur that ever existed. Didn't see that one coming. Jim, you know it would be really dastardly if we snuck out of here and got to the client first. <laughs>
He's running! Damn it! Damn it. What? What is this supposed to be? It's a monkey. Jim, get real. This is not a monkey. It's got a hula skirt and a blue nose. Hold on, hold on. Is this him? What? Is that him? It's him. Do something. Get out. What? Go. What am I going to do? I don't... Go slash his tires. Go dead his hood. That's it? Oh, that's great. That's like a five second delay. White, go! Does this thing have turbo? Nitrous? Hit the Nas. Nas? You mean like in Fast and Furious? Yeah. Oh yeah, I definitely have Nas. Hit the Nas. Are you sure? Yes. Brace yourself. Three, we got two, it. Go. one. Here we go! Ready? Go, 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 go. Pennsylvania Solar Tech. That but sounds fake. I mean? told you. Stop. You're an exec at Stark Industries, a Will corporation you, you inherited Stop. from Stop. your father. Here's the story. They need Meredith somewhere else ASAP, okay? okay. So you're taking over. You just okay. gotta get her out of there as soon as you can. All right, okay, I can do that. Then what? Then He's... make him pitch to you. Yes. You gotta see what he's got. Exactly. Okay, and remember, you this. you're not gay. Stop it. It's okay. gonna be great. And listen, if anything else happens, just roll with it. Meredith. Oh, I, uh, Manuel. This is Manuel, my cleaning man. He doesn't speak any English. Uh, hola, que tal? Como esta, señor? Uh, Manuel, Clino el window. You need to speak. What else we got? So, this hot chocolate thing with Packer. None of your business. Well, you know you can't actually poison them, right? It isn't poison. It's a laxative. People take laxatives all the time. This is just a lot more of a laxative. Let me handle it. I really think we should join forces on this one. Really? What do we think? What would drive him crazy? I know. Here we go. Pepto-Bismol in his hot chocolate. You have got to stop with the hot chocolate stuff. I was thinking maybe we could jam his drawers so that they only come out two inches, and then that way you can see everything in them, but you can't get at it. Does Edgar Allan Poe know about that one? So sinister. <laughs> That wouldn't annoy a person at all. Where, you, where do you come up with this okay. stuff? Okay. All right, well, this isn't my best, but call Froggy 101. Say that we're the tour manager for Justin Bieber and we're giving away free tickets. We give him a number to call for the tickets, and it's his number. Who is Justice Bieber? He... It's a crime-fighting beaver. Well, thanks. Will do. Absolutely. Now, when you get down there, Joe's a little bit uh, forgetful, so she may have locked the gate, but what you're going to do is go ahead, hop it, and just head back to the pool. That sounds weird. It is weird. Look at you, perceptive. Now I know why Joe's kept her eye on you. <laughs> and you make sure to get down there, check out the Harry Potter world. Whatever you want to do in your spare time is up to you. Harry Potter world is supposed to be fantastic. Apparently, as soon as Corbett found out I wanted to come in off the road, Joe offered me a cushy new job in Tallahassee. And here's the best part. I'm a huge alligator nerd. I can name you every genus, every subspecies. Also, I'm a huge boob nerd. Check it out and have a free butter beer right. on us. Keep the receipt and we'll get you back. What well, are you doing? This, uh, All right, just, just pack Very your bags. important client. And uh, be sure to bring those swimming trunks. Bye now. Bye. I cannot believe this. You're sending Packer to Florida? Why? You He's gave him my desk. Okay. So you're tricking him into flying to Florida. This wasn't my first choice. Jim had so many better ideas. You have to tell him. You have to tell him what you did. No, 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 no. That, that is not in the plan. That is actually anti what we're doing. He is my oldest friend. I am going to tell him. Wait, why don't we come up with a plan that we're all happy about? Yeah, that, 